The 1141st Bloodhounds from Kansas City have been bringing the hunt to the enemy and teaming up with an old friend to get the job done. Reporting from Salerno, Afghanistan, I'm Public Affairs Officer Lieutenant Seth Iliff. The 707th Explosive Ordnance Disposal Company regularly sends out a team of EOD with the 1141st to help them dispose of the bombs they find. The route clearance patrols use their own techniques to find the IEDs, but once found, it's up to EOD to properly get rid of them and mitigate any additional risks at the suspected IED sites. However, Specialist Cody Earl, a member of the EOD team, is quick to explain that what the soldiers on the ground see isn't the whole story. First off, we attack the, the, the whole circuit of, of from the builder to the person who emplaces it to uh, you know the people funding it and everything else. And the, and the way we do this is we go to the IED, we try to disarm it, we bring it back for the evidence so that the infantry can go out and catch the bad guy. The soldiers are happy to travel with EOD. At the very least, it means that they have an additional knowledge base by which to fight the enemy. And the hardworking soldiers in the route clearance patrols are granted a brief reprieve when EOD is out on the ground. They know that once the bomb is removed, prepped, and blown, that's one less bomb to worry about. One less bomb to harm their fellow soldiers. Reporting from Afghanistan, I'm Lieutenant Seth Iliff.